Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Ana Cole. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. Um, in today's video, we are going to go ahead and try out the Lovecraft Beauty eyeshadow palette. I believe this was called Warm Rituals. I received this in my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus this month. It's a super neutral palette, so obviously we're going with a pretty simple neutral look. Um, I'm going to try and keep this short and to the point. Let me find a crease. All right, I am going to start out with Agni, which is the shade here. Just pop that into the crease. The palette does have a small mirror. All right, next I'm going to go in with Foulness on the outer corner of the lid. Um, next I'm going to, I don't even know. Hmm. I think I'm just going to go straight to the shimmers. And I'm going to put this shade here, which is Pyroi or Pyroes. I'm just going to stick that on the lid. Okay, um, I think this here is another shimmer pyra, I think. Yeah, it is. Um, so I'm going to take a little bit of that with the other side of the brush and just place a little bit of that on the inner part of the lid just to create a little bit. I don't know why I'm using not the mirror on the palette. Just to soften that gold a little bit. Okay, so the shimmers do play pretty well together. Um, lower lash line. Just going to follow the same pattern. If I have a liner brush, I'm going to have to use something else. Eh, we're just going to use this concealer looking brush. I'm going to start with the foulness on the outer corner bringing and then put the gold and then the pyra shade. Just follow the same exact pattern that's on the lid.
right, and then on the inner corner, I'm going to go in with pyrite, which is this one here. I'm going to go in with my Stila um, brown eyeliner. All right, and I just put that right along the lash line. Um, and then for mascara, I'm just going to use this Lily Lashes mascara. I think this, yeah, Triple X mascara. All right, and lastly, we need to do lips. Um, I think everything over here I have is neutral. Nope, we have this. So we're going to use our Tarte a show lipstick in the shade Cruisin'. I really like this lipstick. It's like hydrating. Um, and it has a nice color. Every time I wear this lipstick, people are like, I love that lipstick color. As far as the palette goes, I mean, the colors, obviously the color scheme works together. It's all, it's browns and golds. Um, I really did like the shimmers. Um, they did play well together and they blended together. Um, <clears throat> what didn't I use? The only shade I didn't use was this shade here. Um, which is Taraja, Saraha, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Um, but it's just like a super light. So, I mean, if you wanted to use the brown on the whole lid um, and then use this to lighten it up, you can do that. Um, but, I mean, you have six shades. You can create only so many looks. I do like the look that I created. I do wish that I would have used the second gold on the lid and then used the lighter shade in the inner corner. But I still like how it looks. I mean, the colors work. There's color payout. Um, so the swatches looked beautiful, but you know, when you use brushes, it always looks a little different. So I think it still looks good, even when applying it with a brush. Um, now I did my entire face beforehand. I used basically the same products that I've been using. So I used my e.l.f. Daily Hydration Moisturizer. Um, I couldn't find my Laura Mercier primer. It's probably somewhere obvious I just didn't see it um, and I use my Urban Decay All Nighter uh, primer I do like this primer I received this from Influencer first um, I did really like it um, I got that for free from Ulta with a purchase um, then I use my Fenty cream blush in the shade Petal Poppin I use the Urban Decay foundation the peach perfect there it is the peach perfect foundation and then of course i use the concealer the born this way naturally radiant concealer which is not here in front of me for some reason and then i just use my Too faced diamond lights and mine is in the shade canary diamond for highlights um i use my siate london extraordinary powder to set my face, it's almost gone. I'm trying to use it so that it's empty. I'm trying to use products that they're gone. So you'll be seeing me using the same products. I've said that before. You know, I'm going to keep using the same products until the products are gone because I don't want things to continue to go to waste. I'm also refraining from purchasing anything really, um, but especially bases. Because one, it's nearly impossible to do a full day wear test right now with having to wear a mask. So I'd have to stay home the entire day, which is just not possible to stay home the entire day you know you, you have to go to work you have to do grocery runs whatever you need to do um so yeah i'm just not buying base products um and then i use my item beauty i have a brow pencil i think that's it i'm just going to set with the all-nighter setting spray All right, um, so that palette, I do like it. It is something that is usable. It is something that you can use for everyday normal wear. I liked it. That is a palette that I did not pick. It's the palette that um, Ipsy picked for me. 
Um, so I'm glad they did. I mean, I like it. They This brand does have other palettes, I believe, on Ipsy's website. I'm not positive, though. So, I mean... I would like to try something that has maybe colors in and not just like a neutral palette. Um, but for a neutral, it's not bad. And this is a nice size for like travel. But that's it. That's all I got for this one. If you do like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay up to date with new videos. New videos will be coming guaranteed at least one a week. Um, I did get my premium box. So I'm going to do the unboxing. Um, and then I will do the try on for the boxes this weekend. So I will see you guys in the next one. Hope you've got us today. Bye now.